The following podcast is rated M for Mature. What is up, you guys? Welcome to another episode of the Rating Pending Podcast. I am your host, Victor the Red. Evan. <laughs> Evan. Hey, everyone. Uh, Evan, so before we start... You what? Know, you know that... Uh, <coughs> you know that Gwent, the Witcher card game, is announced. Puñeta, <laughs> sí! I just wanted to hear that. Yes. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> so welcome to another that episode of the Rating Pending. Pen- um, yeah, it was not. Wink, wink. Um, so here with me, Modern Mega, Rachno, and Solix Base. Yellow. Woo. Woo. So this topic for this it's episode, the topic. topic. Yeah, it's 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 not. A, it's like obvious. We have E3 right around the corner. And you know, everybody has to make some predictions. So, without further ado, shall we? Fuck yeah, yeah. why not? Yeah. Yeah. So, so, Sunday, it's, uh, well, I don't know about Sunday. We're being so getting ridiculous. released. We're getting released everywhere. We're getting fucking trailers everywhere before you like, three. They couldn't wait. No, they but no, said, but I understand it. I understand it why. I understand why you cannot cram all that fucking thing on, the, on E3, on the I conferences. I can't wait. Because if they can just cram all that. No, but uh, you you don't you're un, you're not understanding. You cannot cram up all that on the conferences when they only last like what two two hours two hours and a half. Have some yeah, new stuff. Like, you cannot cram that up. Uh, but it's fine. We're getting these uh, teasers and official announcements and stuff. Whoa, so, <laughs> so this Sunday we have the EA and Bethesda conference. One at uh, one p.m. Uh, Pacific time, the other one at uh, 7 uh, Mm p.m. Pacific time. So, let's start with EA. Guys, are you waiting for something from EA? Uh, Mostly news for Battlefield 1. But other than that, I'm really iffy on most of what EA do, except for obviously Mass Effect. I'm really hopeful for something about that. But uh, Mass Effect and Battlefield 1 will probably be the things I am hoping for. For Mass Effect? Yeah. for Mass Effect, I'm just waiting. I'm um, just want a release date. I can't wait for the future. Oh, de- definitely, definitely. I want a release date. <laughs> G- I, I need me, a release date. Give me a release date. Maybe show me some of the gameplay. They could. And... They could they're, they're, I'm pretty sure they're gonna. They're, they're gonna show gameplay. They're gonna show gameplay, but th- uh, this is another thing. Um, if they do, pretty sure they're gonna hold it up for a PlayStation experience. Pretty Most much. likely. Maybe. Because. Well, it me. It, okay, it's. It's really debatable when you think about it, considering the fact that it started first on Xbox. Yeah. So they might either show it on both sides or just show it by themselves, which I think would be a little better for the time frame. Could be. Could be. Like, yeah, if, if since, anything... Since we're getting the press conference on Sunday, um, they're, they're having their own, you know, they're having their own show as Bethesda, like all separate. Yep. Uh, exactly. And- so Mass Effect, yeah, I, I, I just want a release date. I I'm saying qu- uh, obviously quarter for uh, quarter one, 2017. Even though that's I think that's what they said, but if it's quarter one, I say February or March. What do you say? I I say summer for 2017. I, th- I say March. You say March as well? Probably. Yeah. They, what, what do you they say? Had some, they had some really good sales. I, uh, I, I think March. Or March. You gotta go with March, uh, Evan. Yeah, mostly for hope because you know birthday is in March. Carl- Carlos goes with filled. Carlos goes with summer, even yep. though they say quarter one. <laughs> uh, Maybe it's gonna be delayed, motherfucker. You don't know. It's a possibility. Okay, okay if it gets delayed, delay it till November seven. I'll be happy with that. Everybody <laughs> would be happy with that. <laughs> it's like, oh look, it's a, it's happy in seven day. Here, have the game. <laughs> Better be a discount, motherfucker. Battlefield One, of course, we're gonna get more. I'm pretty sure we're gonna get uh, oh, gameplay, a footage, a gameplay, gameplay footage. Uh, they said Definitely. that they're gonna have a 64 player battle live. So uh, I would love, so. I would, I would really love if they announce a demo like they've done before. They're gonna do uh, it. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, they're. They said they're already gonna do it. Okay, good because I honestly adore the demos. I want. I'm see hoping the for the data. return. Of so the giraffe people. Jesus. I oh, want the it. giraffe people to come back. For those who are listening in and obviously do not know what I mean by giraffe okay. people, okay. in the demos, there was a glitch where the characters, when Battle going into three. prone, 
would stretch out their fucking necks, and head floating the in the air, and look like horrible. They're... They were nightmare fuel. And, they and were I had dubbed and they them were... giraffe people. And they were shooting up the ass. Did that happen yeah. in Battlefield 4? What? I don't remember. Can, can I don't remember. That, I don't think so. Can we put so. the picture no, of that, that in, the, in the banner for this episode? Sure. Do it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Oh God! I'm I'm already imagining it. Oh, Jesus! Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm gonna get the scared. For you. <laughs> so uh, Battlefield One. We're obviously we're gonna get some gameplay of that. Yep. Uh, yeah. I want to see a a date for the alpha. A date for the alpha. Um, what do you say? It, or beta? Or for Battlefield One, when is it come out? It's gonna come out in October, right? Yeah. Mm hmm. So Titanfall Two. When does that come out next month? I I don't know. It releasing okay. releasing Titanfall two and Battlefield one right on yeah, that uh, on stupid. that time slot. It's it's stupid and it's just you're just butchering the market on first person shooters at the moment. I and, think they'd uh, be butchering Titanfall. Uh, yeah, pretty much. Battlefield, Battlefield one really seems like the, the shoot the shooting experience that if you're a hardcore shooter, especially of you know massive battle games like Battlefield. Watching something from World War One, and it's a new genre. Is liter- exactly, it's the newest. Uh, it's the most untouched thing in shooting right now. You literally have people have never touched World War One except for the uh, Verdum, which isn't even a triple A title game. So, in the massive ga- gaming E3 uh, community. No one has seen a World War One World War One game, so this will be amazing. Like, or yeah. first if they pull it off, of, obviously. And uh, you know, if if I were to put Titanfall, I would just delay it. Uh, yeah, I would just definitely. put it. I just just put it on uh, quarter one, 2017. Obviously. Christmas. Uh, no, no, no. Like, uh, remember, uh, Carlos, we're having we're having shooters on this fall. We have Gears of War four. We're having Battlefield one, and we're having um. It won't, we're having uh, uh, what is this one? Titanfall two and, and Call of Duty Advanced uh, Infinite Warfare. Sorry, Infinite Warfare. Infinite Warfare. And you know, it's just uh, it's too much. It's too much for shooters. There, and there's there needs to have a balance for that. Yeah. yeah. Um, what are we Witcher. The yeah. Series, series. So, do you think they're gonna release a not release but announce? Uh, no, the trailer for the next, the Amy Henning Star Wars Visceral game Star Wars. Mm, I'm really hopeful. Yeah. I really want to see something new about Star Wars because honestly, the Battlefront, uh, EA Battlefront, yeah, was not really what people were expecting. We were expecting the full package, and did they deliver in the nostalgia and? The amazing. It feels like a Star Wars game. Terrain, That's... yes, they they delivered. They actually, if I were to to say a percentage of how well the game was, it was easily a seventy a seventy five eighty percent Star Wars game. Twenty percent was literally leaving the most fun out of it because uh, I'm sure everyone here agrees with me that the campaign for any Star Wars there, game not is. Camp- is what matters, and they didn't have anything. They didn't have a, st- a story mode. Having heard... one is amazing. And even if you didn't have a campaign or a story mode, if you'd at least put the conquest mode that was available in Battlefront 2, you would have easily prevented a lot of hate from the people. Yep. The thing is that uh, I've heard that there was... I don't know. I don't know if I should believe that, but... Uh, I heard that EA had to uh, pull the plug in some of the content because Star Wars uh, The Force Awakens was about to release and they didn't have time so they needed to capitalize on the movie so they released that a month later, uh, a month before and it had to took out some some stuff. I think there was, there was going to be a campaign but they took it out. That's sad. And, well, they uh, should at least it, kept working on it and added it yeah. as a DLC. No, it's just the only thing but... that pisses me off is just the lack of content and just selling it for sixty dollars. It's you know, oh, de- it's, definitely, it's stupid. definitely. No, it's two special film environments and it's it was really a, it, overall it was a flop on what it, it should it, have been, what it should it have been. It was just really, really underwhelming. Yeah. Yeah, that that was basically it. It was not a good resurrection of. 
the franchises. Oh. Do you think we're so, gonna have a maybe if 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 it's not the Visceral Games trailer or teaser or announcement, do you think we're gonna have a I don't know a teaser as for Battlefront 2 as well? <laughs> Highly unlikely. I don't. They, they, I doubt it. Because they they it. already announced it for apparently next year. The Battlefront if, 2. Yeah. If they do, I hope uh, they learn a lot from this previous attempt. They're probably. And when gonna I do say a lot, bullshit. I mean that they have better had started right now. They're probably gonna do the same bullshit that they did in the other E3. Just show us. No, they're pictures. just gonna add newer guns and new dances for the characters. If they showed in-game footage, I swear I'm gonna be pissed, because <laughs> that's that's just the bullshit excuse to definitely to show something. It's like no, no, no. show me show me the goods. I I doubt it though, because their golden child right now is gonna be Battlefield One. <laughs> Actually, now that I realize it, when they showed the trailer for Battlefront, there were a lot of places they showed that you never actually even go. That's true. Tatooine. The city, you never go there, and they actually show the the troop, troopers getting down from the ships. Well, there's, there's even a place that looks like the Death Star's uh, hallways. Yeah. Well, My God, there was a lot DLC. of there was a lot of con so content you know. on it. Holy shit! Well, uh, so what next? Obviously, obviously, EA is gonna have some sports. FIFA sports, yeah, most sports, sports. yeah, yeah. But I, I have nothing to add on. I that. can't I've wait for been, it's just, no, it's just, I have never been a. Uh, uh, I just want to see Pele again on the screen. Yeah, I am Pele. I am Pele. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Please, just do it. I know you're gonna do the scripted, but do it anyway. E three, if you do it, EA. E three, E three is gonna do. It. EA. <laughs> Yeah, but we, it's obviously we're gonna have some FIFA stuff. Obviously, yeah. Uh, yeah. Even, even more Madden, of course. Uh, Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Don't showing know. stuff that looks like it's new, but it's really not. Anything, anything they else for EA? They added more sweat to the person. Though. Anything else for EA? Uh, uh, we already talked about. Awesome? You think a new IP? You think they're gonna do another? You know, like they did with Unravel, another indie hey. spotlight. Hey, who knows? That could be. That's actually really nice of EA. Because Unravel, I played it. It's pretty good. I haven't played it. It's good. It's 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 really good. It's uh you know it's not the best game, but hey, it's it's. It's you a know, good game. You know yeah. th there's a game that they announced, I believe it was last year, and I actually want to see a little more about it. What Two games game? actually. Which for me? Uh, it it wasn't for me, but in general, like it's two indie games that they announced on the side. Which is. Uh, Recore. Oh, but that's at Microsoft. Yeah, we haven't touched yeah. that. It no, but it's, it's like a, it, they came to mind per se. Like since we we're talking about Unravel, Unravel was actually one of the lower tiered games per se that they showed last year. Yeah. Um, and another one that I haven't seen anywhere. This one's actually from Rare. Uh, it was Sea of Thieves. Sea of Thieves. They're, I'm pretty sure they're gonna show that on. Oh yeah. Microsoft, obviously. Yeah. Um, He's I'm pretty sure. So, so EA has nothing else to offer, to be honest, because nope. we exactly. uh, we already have. I, I just say that. You know the Star Wars. The Star Wars completely. Is the one thing their that golden child in that conference is going to be Battlefield One. Yeah. They're going to try to sell you that complete, and it's already sold. So, so it's mostly be... sold unless they fuck up. So yeah. you know, that I'm, the one thing that I'm waiting for EA from EA, it's uh, Star Wars um, Visceral Games trailer. Waiting for that, and you know maybe Battlefront Two, but that's just a long shot. Uh, for Bethesda. Now yeah, that's that's, this, that's that's the I... second that's the second press conference that's, of Sunday. That's I, I don't know. Hard. I don't know what they're gonna show. Uh, okay, obviously. I'll be honest. For Bethesda, I'm always waiting with bated breath because Bethesda, at least to me, it always feels like they manage to deliver on what they want to give us. Uh, they've always given us the Elder Scrolls and Fallout franchises, which managed to always pick at least a high spot in the mm -hmm. gaming community. Uh, Fallout 4, I'm sure we can all agree, was a great success. Success, yeah. I, I didn't like it much. Uh, but it you don't like Bethesda games? Shut up. I, I, I actually I like don't... Bethesda games. I don't finish them. I, yeah, no, you. that's a curse. That's not the game. That's a curse. That's your fault. <laughs> <laughs> I am a fan of the Elder Scrolls franchise. I've said it a thousand times. Well, I was oh, never online. actually... I was never actually a real fan of Fallout. I never actually played it a lot. I played... Three in, Ve in New Vegas, but I never actually owned a copy, so I never enjoyed it to the fullest. But Fallout 4, with all its new things and changes, 
was actually fucking amazing for me. And I'm still playing it, playing it in survival. Died a lot. A, a very much amount of times. It's actually kind of frustrating, but yeah. Uh, I'm really hoping that Bethesda shows something about a new Scrolls title. I doubt it. Uh, yeah. I, I, I also soon. doubt it. I'm just hoping. <laughs> Maybe a Fallout Online? No. no uh, shut okay, up. you're hoping for too much. Oh, yes. Hey, they did the same thing with Elder Scrolls, motherfucker. Yeah, but that, that, but that wasn't Bethesda. <laughs> Elder yeah, Scrolls they... wasn't good. Um, but uh, uh, for a new acceptable. Elder Scrolls, for a new Elder Scrolls, uh, Elder, Scroll, Elder, Elder Scrolls, Elder um, Scrolls, I doubt it, man. It's uh, it's too soon. Maybe it's, it's, it's okay. I, I also doubt it. I'm just hoping. No, I know, I know. But uh, um, a new IP from Bethesda, I Wolfenstein Two? Question mark. Oh, that's not bad. That'll be interesting. Another actually. Wolfenstein. Um, they did say they were gonna show off more Doom. DLC announcements. Maybe a completely new IP. Yeah, that'll be uh, definitely. I like to see something new to the mix. In Maybe the a uh, more DLCs world. for Fallout. Yeah, no, it's that's just obvious. Uh, yeah, we already know that. But they need to, they need to show more stuff. Of course, we're gonna have a, uh, a Dishonored 2 gameplay. How long is the the, the press conference? conference? It's like two hours. That's stuff? Like two two hours. hours? Yeah, that like an hour and a half, two hours. They need to show a lot of stuff. Yeah, they they but not necessarily because Fallout Four took a big <laughs> it took big time. Uh, it, it took a lot of time to show because they show you first yeah, the concept art. They show you this, 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 yeah, and that. that time. But and now they then don't have they anything. show Doom. They show everything from Doom, and then they go back to Fallout, and then they but gave you the. Remember, they show you the Fallout shelter, which yeah. Carlos spent eighty dollars. Um, and we and I thought we don't talk about. <laughs> and then we had the release day on November, of course. But um, for <laughs> for Elder Scrolls, like Evan said, I it's. It's a long shot, but I've heard rumors. Yeah. I heard rumors that there's a Skyrim remaster gonna they gonna Ooh. show, but I don't know. Oh. I don't know. Uh, Bethesda, I've, but I've never, did. I've, I've never if seen two hours. I've never they seen Bethesda show. I, I've never seen Bethesda do remasters. If they do a remaster, I would like to see Oblivion be remade. Yes, please. With nice, with better graph, more you like know, modernized graphics, <laughs> and that would be amazing. And I'd and be happy. And support. Yeah, I feel like they could yes. remake Morrowind and Oblivion and just sell it as a bundle. If they do that, no, no. Oh. If they just do the, if they just do an Elder Scrolls package, they my piggy E3. bank is breaking right now. They won E3 if they do that. The thing is, they, you know, you no, know. literally the conference is gonna end. They're gonna shut down the entire building of E3, kick everyone out, and just give them metal. The thing is <laughs> so that Bethesda. if they do that, if they do the remaster, um, obviously it's gonna be. Uh, put on PS4, Xbox One, yep. and with mod support, like they did with Hopefully. Fallout 4. Uh, I I could definitely see that, but Sky uh, Skyrim Remaster, I I doubt it. Maybe a backwards compatible title for Xbox Probably One. Probably because it is too. It is quite early for. Yeah, and, and the it thing to be and, remastered itself. And to be honest, it's a nostalgia value. Uh, Skyrim. It's been it, it went out like it was out five years ago, but you know. We, no, and and the modding community has kept it alive in PC for a long time. I've still been playing it. <laughs> yep. Same. Except when I. Cursed client decided to erase everything, and I had to, you know, give up because I'm not gonna do that all over again. <laughs> Fuck that shit. Yay. <laughs> but yeah, other than that, the community has kept it alive. Even console players bought it in PC, like me, just what to play it more with mods. What about Prey yep. too? Prey. Hmm. Prey. Did you, did you guys remember uh, that? I don't know that much about Prey. Stuff? Yeah, that's. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's from Bethesda. How old is uh, it? Wow, it's it's it was it was canceled a few months uh, like a, a couple of years ago, and then was reinstated. I don't oh. know. It's it, it, I'm not I'm not familiar <laughs> with the title. But, I'm, uh, they t I'm they not either. This is actually topic. the first time I uh, they, about But it. they say that it's pretty good. So uh, this is a really good topic, guys. Yeah. yeah. So, but this uh, I don't know. Just Doom, maybe a Doom DLC announcement. Of they course. said DLC announcement. Okay, there we go. Yeah. So. Dishonored 2, it's gonna come out when? November? Yeah, I think so. 
Wait, Dishonor is this stuff? Dishonor 2, yes. Come on, Carlos, yeah. yes. <laughs> Goddamn, <laughs> Carlos. That's like the only <laughs> game that I'm not. I don't know, it's just I didn't I didn't I didn't like I didn't I didn't like the first one. Uh, people liked it. I, I, I enjoyed it. I did not love it. Why did I enjoy it? Simple. Legion of Rats. Oh, God. Screaming victims. It was perfect. Of course. For me. Of course. I literally snuck. I didn't even sneak. I just rats. Everyone died. <laughs> I hated the stealth mechanic. It was broke. I'm not killing anyone. The rats are doing it. I'm innocent. <laughs> <laughs> so, it, you know, but this that hasn't, it, like, I don't know much, like, what no. they, keep, they should keep showing. I think that's about it. If it's two hours, they need to. Yeah, no, that's about it. Uh, so, yeah. going on Monday, uh, the first press conference of the day is Microsoft. Yep. Yes. So, we, you know, you got your Gears of War 4 gameplay, of course, a story no, gameplay, course. at least. Uh, ReCore, something that uh, Jose um, mentioned. Solid. Base, yeah. Oh, I forgot um, mentioned. Sea of Thieves. What else? Sea of Thieves. Sea of Thieves. Uh, uh, Crackdown Crack three. Down three. You think there's gonna be a new IP? I'm really hoping so, but Maybe. more than uh, more than games for Microsoft, I'm really trying. To, I'm hoping to see something more VR related, or maybe more about uh, the Hololens. Uh, the Xbox well, modular yeah. because uh, they have, they have, they've been being quiet a lot with that. Yeah, they've oh, been very no. quiet about it ever since they showed it, and not only that, since PlayStation is already jumping, already made the leap, and it's jumping into the VR community, it would be nice for Microsoft to try and keep up with that department, or at least, or at least show us more about the Hololens, so we can see how it'll be implemented more into gaming. Because they only showed it with Minecraft, and let's be honest. It seems a little bit, uh, how do I say this, uh, handicapped for the gaming community. Okay. Because yeah. you really can't do much with it since it is off the screen. Everything is in your environment. You're not going to be running around as if you're using a sword like a maniac. You're going to hit people and things. So it's not a good idea. Uh, so I really want to see more about this. I doubt you know, it, though. There's a really curious thing with HoloLens and with, uh, what's the other one? Uh, the, so, the one for PlayStation. I forget Morpheus. the name. Is it Morpheus? Ugh. Well, it's uh, not okay. Morpheus. Well, it's, it's just PlayStation <laughs> VR. I call it Morpheus because I was the uh, I'm just going to go with VR because screw that name and everything it stands for. Uh... Oh, okay, now I understand why. <laughs> inside joke, inside joke. Inside joke. Everyone, Everyone shut up. up. The name is cool, though. I like that. The thing with it is, from what I've noticed, VR is focusing a lot in putting you in the driver's seat directly. Same thing that Oculus would do. Meanwhile, HoloLens yeah, yeah. is focusing on open on creating exactly this world atmosphere in front. Like you know how how we see a lot in mostly sci-fi shows and movies how you have like this warship sort of like chess. Yeah. Yeah. The thing is that it, uh, the it HoloLens is actually that. an environment uh, <laughs> creation. It's the first holographic lens that yeah. it's being made available for the community. The entire idea is for you to be able to walk around and uh, the good thing about Microsoft is that when they make these kind of gadgets, they don't think just about the gaming community. This can be actually used for creating games, characters, even just making a bike and a model for a company. So it really has a lot of implica uh, real world implications besides the gaming community, but that's exactly it. They showed us the potential overall. They haven't specified what this will do for us as gamers besides just being God in Minecraft and saying, let there be light and lightning. So I really want to see more about this. If they're going to show it as a, more of a strategy game kind of thing where I can see my legions of soldiers fighting below me and I can tell them what to do in a more interactive way, which would be fucking amazing, and I actually made the movie in my head. Uh, I was literally thinking about all of that. I was actually thinking more about Total War Warhammer sending my little uh, green skins yeah, to yeah, death. Of course. Ah, the beauty. But yeah, shut up. <laughs> so, um, so yeah. um, for hardware, you know, they, they apparently there's multiple sources that said uh, Xbox Scorpio or uh, Slim um, might, or might have an announcement one and a there. half. Actually, both both things are separate things. So the Scorpio and the Slim is something separate. So you think it's gonna be the Xbox One 
Slim is gonna be like the cheaper version and uh, Scorpio is something at super advanced. Hey, what about Xbox One and a half? The thing is, okay, the, th the thing is, you know how PlayStation is gonna release another PS4 with 4K compatibility? Which, it's uh, stupid, but yeah. 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 What Xbox is trying to do is they're gonna release a Slim. Yeah. And apparently they're gonna release Scorpio, which is basically the equivalent to when Nintendo did. Yes, where it was just faster and it had a better process. Mm -hmm. So it's not really a necessity, but if you're one of those really picky gamers that complains about, oh, I don't know, 11 seconds of loading in a game like Bloodborne, then but that, they I can fix see that. why they would. <laughs> but they, they, fix they, they already fixed that, so. They yeah. fixed it. Doesn't mean that, that there wasn't any complaints about it. Oh, it's but the game's okay. Dark but, Souls 3. but it was it's but still it was, happening in Dark Souls. But, but there's this thing, Jose. Like they, the um, yeah, it it had that problem. That's super fucking ridiculous loading time. But they fixed it. Uh, why yeah. updating it? They didn't have to upgrade the the hardware exactly. for that specific <laughs> game, so they can like have faster loads. But I know that where you're true. going. I know where you're going. Um, yeah. I for the Xbox One, I don't think they're gonna say nothing about that. I don't know. Uh, I, I don't say it's a hoax, but I don't think they're gonna. They're gonna say do hush shit. hush. I'm pretty that. sure they're gonna have some more deals uh, for the Xbox One, maybe a price yep. cut. Uh, I say more titles for backwards compatibility. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. but probably announced, not that Red it's Dead like Redemption? for released. Uh, okay, that would be pretty okay. good. That would be that would be fucking awesome if they did. Uh, now that we're talking about Red Dead. Do you think Rockstar is gonna show up with uh, another Red Dead game? Maybe Red Dead Revolution, Red Dead Revenge. I really hope so, cause it is the time for it. But it, the, here's the thing. I don't want to see a two. Yeah, that's no, all exa I don't no want. exactly. No. I don't want to see a two, at all. I that's just stupid. But hey, the name Red Dead Revenge, Red Dead Revolution. Those. I like Revolution. Like, yeah, Revolution. You had a good, fucking, good idea there. Uh, the thing is that. You know, Rockstar, this is a fact, Rockstar has never been a fan of showing up at E3. That's not their style. Nope. They always do this, uh, you know, these events, they do, you know, these small events they do, uh, live streaming, and like it happened with GTA V. It was a random ass moment because they announced that week, I think it was a week before. That was a day that I remember I took, I took my brother, uh, I took him out to... To the airport, he need, he was gonna travel to Orlando, and that same morning, I woke up just waiting, and I just saw the trailer, and that's pretty much it. And then the fucking internet went crazy, and that was it. They they announced a uh, GTA 5, or they're gonna announce a new GTA game, but nobody knows what's about, and they they show it. But for them to be on E3 last time, I remember them being on E3. It was fucking GTA 4. Yeah. And GTA 5 wasn't on. Well, okay, E3. we know that if somebody from Rockstar comes and talks, we know it's Red Dead. It, you know the chances, Dead. the chances of a Rockstar representative or somebody from Rockstar showing a game are the chances as Gabe Newell showing up at E3 saying something. Boy, you can dream, Victor. Yeah. Boy, you can fucking dream. <laughs> hey, that's a fact. <laughs> that's that's a fucking fact. Watch it. Watch him release Portal 4 before shut, freaking shut PC party. Gamer. Shut PC Gamer, he's gonna come and just <laughs> blow your fucking uh, mind. I, I don't know about PC Gaming. PC Gaming show last year was really bad. It was it, it, pretty, pretty it bad. It was a snooze fest. Yeah, it was, it was hey, bad. I was, I was doing my job. Storm, I was doing my job on releasing the news, but I was I was sleeping. I was. I couldn't bear. But, but no, that's the only thing I like about PC gaming. When I saw it, I remember I tagged you, Evan, and fucking Jan. Um, yeah. More tags. I re remember that... I tagged y'all on that. Um, so, you know. I was with you. <laughs> we saw that. No, you weren't with me. See, you thought no. I was in your no. house. No, 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 no. That was, that, was, that was on a Monday. No. I saw, I no. saw this on no. a Wednesday. No, no, no. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, so, for Microsoft, uh, what else? What do you think they're going to... Oh, Capcom on Microsoft, so or Capcom on PlayStation, one of those two. So for Capcom, I say all Resident Evil, Resident Evil everything, Resident Evil Umbrella Core, uh, Resident Evil Seven, 
pretty sure a trailer for Resident Evil 7, if not Resident Evil 7, re uh, some Resident Evil. Uh, I would love if they. S oh, okay, yeah. Now I'm thinking about it. Th this could actually uh, fit on the PlayStation conference because if they actually do, they could release Resident Evil out Resident, Resident Evil Resident Evil Outbreak PlayStation 2 Classic on PS4 remastered. Ooh. Oh my God, yes. With fucking trophies and online, I wanted that game so bad. Uh, but not a remake or a remastered version for PS4, just the PS2 Classic optimized to 1080p mm. with trophies. I would fucking love that. Uh, but what about 2K, guys? You think there's going to be 2K games? Capcom, I'm, I say Resident Evil everything. I don't see anything else. I don't see any Devil May Cry announcement. Is it Crackdown 2K? No, uh, Crackdown, oh. uh, Crackdown. I think it's Microsoft, just Microsoft Studio. It's just Microsoft. Oh. Yeah, I, I'm not mistaken. I could. Oh wrong. wait, I forgot one. Uh, they're probably gonna do announcement for season two of Quantum shit. You think so? You guys think about Quantum? Yeah. They said that they're gonna release they more will. seasons. Not, I don't know. Uh, Quantum Break. Piece of shit game. I don't know about Quantum Break. If they Quantum actually... shit, you mean? Oh, okay, sorry. <laughs> but uh, for Capcom, I only say Resident Evil everything. I don't think uh, Devil... there's gonna be a Devil May Cry. Uh, no, that that IP is dead. And um, exactly. yeah, I don't think Devil May Cry. Uh, what else? There's more Street Fighter news, but that's on PlayStation. Yeah. Uh, probably a new IP. Yeah, uh, do you think uh, Capcom releasing any IP? No, no, I'm, I'm Microsoft. We're Microsoft. Dude, watch, watch him walk up and say, hey, so let me show you the Mega Man show. <gasps> Yo, shut oh, up. Oh, don't, don't, Dude, don't do that. Up. Don't fuck with my mind like that. <laughs> <laughs> you my name is Modern them. Mega, you motherfucker. <laughs> That's so, why it's funny. So, new IP, ah. interesting. You think, uh... <laughs> You think I need? Wait, wait. How about this? Remember that that cut. that studio that kind of I think what is it? Double Helix. That it's the one studio that re remakes. Uh, yeah, that remakes games such as Killer Instinct. Uh, they were gonna do with uh, what was that game that was canceled? Uh, shit, that is one one weird game. I forgot. I trying to trying to. Remember, but no, I have nothing. I'm not gonna waste Spy time on bit. that one. Uh, maybe it's not important, but uh, <laughs> I'm pretty sure people <laughs> listening to this they already know. There's like fucking screaming on their screen. Yo, stupid dumbass, is this one? If there were people, my name's not important. Hello, darkness, my old friend. It's... Nah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> so, Microsoft, yeah, done deal with Microsoft. I don't see anything yep. else for it. Nope. Uh, Ubi shit. I'm no, sorry, wait, Ubisoft. Wait, wait. We passed PC gaming. No, no, that's that's on a Wednesday. Um, no, it's no, no, no. Uh, like I'm no, I'm just I'm just doing it by the the you know by the schedule. I thought that this was good. Oh, no, this is just Evan's uh, note. This is not our thing. <laughs> that's my <laughs> note, you motherfucker! No, that's Evan's <laughs> note. <laughs> so uh, Ubi shit. I'm sorry, Ubisoft. Yeah, um, soft in the head. Deus Ex Mankind Divided, that's... That's Square Enix, Carlos. Oh. Fucking damn it. God, good job, damn it. good job, Carlos, good job. Uh, you, hey, they're selling it. Not working. So, they, sh they already showed today Watch Dogs 2. Yep. Today is a Wednesday, we are on June 8th. So, they already released a trailer and more, like, basically a developer diary. That was a developer diary, right? Yeah, and the uh, the character and all that stuff. They did a like. I hope I'm hopeful. I'm hopeful that uh, he has you know, a character. That has a personality. Yeah. Like the first game. <laughs> so I'm not gonna say what I said to you guys because I'm not gonna sound like an ass. <laughs> Just shut up. So, um, Ghost Recon Wildlands, right? Always. Ghost Recon Wildlands. Yep. Uh, they're that, gonna show yeah. Me. They're gonna show more about that. I have good hopes for that game. For it Honor. Me too. Honestly, remember. I'll be honest. For Honor. Like I don't care what they say. For about Honor, it. yes. That, that's one, that is the one game. That is the that one, one game that I'm actually interested. in. Well, that's for PlayStation, though. Uh, no, that's from Ubisoft. Yeah, but yeah. no, it's gotta be both consoles. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. It's oh. it's gonna be on both consoles. Uh, stop, Carlos. We know you want exclusives for you, but you gotta stop with the racism. I have. 
I have Xbox, you know, so... We get it. It's okay, you can stop now. The war's <laughs> over, Evan. It's okay. Stop. Get used to it. It's okay. They got pretty sure they're gonna release a gameplay for Ghost Recon Wildlands. I don't know yeah. about I don't know, I don't know about a release date. Pretty sure it's gonna be like next year, summer, fall. I already have a release date. Don't Does I? it? Yeah. No, they. No, it doesn't. Yeah. It's gonna be this year, or the next year. Yeah, I think this year. That's just wait, stupid. No. Wait, wait, That's wait, just wait. stupid. Wait, 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 I'm not sure that. I'm not sure that. Let me go to my Amazon. I don't know. Put putting Ghost Recon this year, I would just kill the division. No, I don't think it's this year. And it's too much Tom Clancy. Stop. They should stop. Um, so, Probably Jose, you want to say something? Jose. So, 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 you know, I've been replaying one of my old games, right? Which is? Uh, Darksiders. Okay. Oh, my so, God. So, so. Oh, my God. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Apparently, <laughs> apparently, there has been multiple teasings throughout last year, since June to November. Of a possibility of having a third installment for the game, but they, weren't they working on it? Because I remember they, they were working on it, and they were going to use will, the original THQ logo just as for a exactly. You know, just but they it. hadn't confirmed who was working on it. Interesting. Mm. And the was, company well, in charge for Dark Siders Three is Nordic Games. Oh boy. Yeah, that is. Uh, <laughs> God. Skip one voice. Uh, oh, by the way, uh, Ghost so Recon cool. Wildlands is January. No, that's that's a that's a uh, not that's an Amazon random fucking. That's the only one they gave us, Victor. No, that's the, the, the pre-order something that hasn't doesn't have a fucking release date. That's gonna give you a January one. Um, Ghost Recon, yeah, they should. Shut up. I don't, I don't know. Just give it for next year, maybe. Maybe in two years. I really don't care, because uh, the division. I had a bad experience with that. I I don't know. I just had a really bad. Don't experience. Don't compare that game to this game. It's like, I don't know. It's it's just an open world game, Carlos. I don't know. It's it's that. It's different. Right, right. How Everything, different? How different, Carlos? Yeah. Explain me. <laughs> Have you seen the world, in the Wildlands? I don't care about the world about Wildlands. You don't care about Ubisoft. You just have hate Pretty in much. your eyes. Pretty much. Uh, Ubi, uh, Ubi shit just <laughs> keeps fucking up everything. Uh, they fucked up the division. They're, I'm pretty sure they're gonna fuck up Rogo's Recon Wildlands, and uh, I don't think they're gonna. Re I don't think they're gonna announce a new Splinter Cell game. That's just cannibalizing oh. the name Tom Clancy all over it. Oh, but that game died slowly. You think a, a new IP is on the way? Maybe. Which is what do you think? I don't know. Prison no Persia. That's not a new IP. No IP, no IP means a new a fucking IP. Something that you never heard of. I know. Don't so. ask. Oh, there's there's a there's another game that's gonna be shown actually, and they Which one? like they release it uh, ukulele. Isn't that Microsoft? Is that, no, that's no. No, that that's a complete. That's okay. Ukulele is being worked on by some of the ex Rare employees. I, I noticed with the trailer. I noticed yeah, everything. Yeah, everything. Everything, everything, everything <laughs> was rare written. <laughs> it's it's the people who were in charge of Banjo Kazooie and the people who were in charge of Donkey Kong Country. Yeah, I saw the. How yeah, was that Ubisoft yeah. though? I'm throwing stuff out. Yeah. Carlos, let me let me remind oh. you. Ubisoft is in no way important enough for me to focus on. So, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna throw things out. I fucking love you, Jose. I love your thinking. <laughs> And if Ubisoft is gonna do anything, like anything whatsoever, don't. That's all I can say about this. Uh, retired. If you have an shop. idea, do the opposite. It's probably the right <laughs> idea. <laughs> exactly. Um, let's face it. What does Ubisoft have to show? What are, what are they gonna show? Oh, we're gonna show you another Assassin's Creed game. We're gonna show you Watch Dogs. Another Two Just Dance game. I don't. I mean, Just Dance has actually been somewhat useful lately. I don't know why. Okay. They're gonna they're gonna announce another one. No, they I, say I, that Sassy The only okay, the only thing the only thing I like about the UB, uh, you, the Ubisoft conference, Aisha Tyler. That's the only thing. <laughs> her her hosting is just awesome. That's it. Unless you're that guy who was cosplaying, or you were doing <laughs> the guy from Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Yeah. And that was cringy. Shit. That was that was cringy. Um. They're probably gonna hype up the movie though. No, um, no. 
they're pretty sure I'm gonna they're they're gonna release a trailer for the next Assassin's Creed for next year. That's uh, definitely is what they're gonna do. So, yeah, yeah, I, I think that, I don't know. Ubisoft doesn't have much. No. Ubisoft, I don't know. I, no I really IP. Don't, I, re really I really good. don't care. Uh, just save Ubisoft, Ubisoft. So and, and Sony. How about Sony? Oh my God, Sony's on. Fuck. Holy uh. shit. <coughs> Okay. First of all, let's well, just know, get out know, of this way. Okay, Sadly, I know, I know that's. I know that Square is probably gonna take uh, some of Sony's time and just show like stuff for Final Fantasy and Kingdom Hearts. Oh, I won't give you that much. Yeah. Oh yeah. Um. Definitely. Probably a little bit more of Horizon Zero Dawn, which I would appreciate even if I don't have a PS4. Okay, the thing is that about Horizon Zero Dawn, uh, which is the the news just broke out. What two days ago? What, yeah. what about? Uh, oh, I don't. It's getting delayed, right? For yeah, next year? it got delayed. Uh, that was something that oh, I already okay, saw that? from a mile away. Not surprised. Uh, I don't know. I I already knew that that shit is gonna get delayed. Uh, it's just obvious for some reason. Um, the game it's it the game it looks so good, but too good to be true to be fucking released this year. Nah. Uh, I it got a release date for February, which is fine. I love it. I, it's my birth month, so fucking great. February, okay with it because March follows February it. February twenty eighth. Inter interesting date though, or twenty seventh. I'm I don't remember. Uh, obviously Sony's gonna show more Call of Duty Infinite Warfare because you know the special Sadly. deal they have. Um, what else? Uh, Horizon Zero Dawn. We talked about that. Uh. Injustice 2 gameplay? No, I doubt it. Maybe. Uh, they could they could give you a story trailer if anything. True. So we can know what's uh, what's up. Like what what's up for this one? Yeah. No Man's Sky. I again. Re I, again, man. Again. It's like again. It's fine. What we, I they need saw. to add stuff. So if they keep they adding stuff, the they, if they keep the fucking adding stuff, or they fucking delay it forever. But yeah. okay, just, guys, they, guys, they you know what? I had it. I had it. I had it. I can't. I can't hold it. I can't fucking hold it. Sony, you motherfuckers. I won my goddamn Last Guardian release date. You're not gonna get it. That still exists. I want my <laughs> fucking <laughs> Last Guardian release date. Damn it. I've been waiting that for that shit a long time. You said this year. Don't be a fucking asshole and fucking delay it. They're gonna they're delay it. The thing they're is, delay it. if I swear to God, if they delay it, I'm done. I'm done. Victor, I, I really don't care. I Big. really don't. No, no. I, I'm, I'm Calm down. Calm I'm down. down. No, fuck that. Calm down. Big. What? How many Puerto Ricans want the lottery, and how many get them? Oh, <laughs> That's your Lottery, chance. not that many. Powerball. <laughs> apparently, we've had some pretty good luck. Yeah, I don't understand this shit. What <laughs> does that has to do? This is not fair. But let's get back to the game. The thing is that the Last Guardian, man. Like, I'm sad now. Last Guardian, <laughs> come I'm on, bored. just Still. The, the, best case scenario, but you know, it's just not gonna happen. Just You're stuttering you imagine, out of I, the pain. You know, I'm just imagining Sean Layden just saying, "And the Last Guardian is being released tonight after the fucking press conference." I was like. What? Dream, <laughs> I just dream, dream. What? <laughs> what? So, I think you remember. I'm pretty sure you remember. One of the biggest things that happened. I remember everything. Last year, right Sometimes. before the ending, right? You're an elephant. How a certain uh, employee, a very specific employee, got kicked oh. out of his company. Uh -huh. I oh. can definitely later see on, this. Later I get on, merged. <laughs> With another company, a pretty big company. The thing is, and has oh, I don't know, maybe taken his logo, <laughs> made a soldier out of it, and little by little continues to show more about. Said I am so ah! like this. <laughs> All right, I swear Ladies to God, and gentlemen, if, if I don't see, I don't even himself <laughs> stand on that stage. No, 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 no. I just, there, I'm just fucking imagining. It. I'm just imagining it. And tell me, hey, <laughs> you, you saw Jose, this? Jose. You, you, you like this? This Jose, is going Jose. for a game. I, I just, I just want to, I want to, I just want that. Ladies and gentlemen, Hideo Kojima from Kojima Productions. I was like, oh my god, and they're gonna show. I, I, can, I can definitely see fucking standing ovation. <laughs> oh yeah. Standing fucking ovation. 
and then he's gonna. I'm pretty sure if the, he, I don't think he's gonna show a teaser. That's no, just too much. But at least, at least of the concept art they're working on, and uh, what to expect. And I'm pretty sure that game is gonna come out in I don't know 2030. <laughs> 2030 for the, for the PlayStation 7. You so it comes this year. What no, no it's Carlos what just you asking. Do? To Carlos, me. stop. No, I, I'm being he real. I, I, I'm being real. That's never he gonna happen. You will join me and rob a bank. That's what we will do. <laughs> Thanks for incriminating me, Evan, right here on the show. It's okay. It's okay. It's <laughs> what I'm here for. I'm that friend. Victor Cabrera and Evan Diaz. Thank you, Carlos. Do not for give a fuck about the law. You guys want their security numbers too? Here it's. <laughs> Hardware. Hey, Trump is going to outlaw Latinos anyway, so who gives a fuck? So for hardware... Might as well give him a reason. PlayStation Neo. Oh, we got there. Yeah, bro. PlayStation Neo. No. Man. Well, that's the thing, I guess. I don't know. I've never really understood I I, I don't understand the stupid concept. idea of just releasing a better version of the PS4. I've never understood the slim idea. I mean, I understand the point of having something smaller so you can fit it somewhere, but... Really? Just make more space. It makes the poor it people can't... feel good. No, yeah, it's just, not, it's just not space, that, Carlos. Cunt. It's just for the PlayStation Neo being, you know, that it's this console that is going to have better processing power, this, this, and that. And... It's literally just to... But, but for the people who it's... bought a PS4 now, fuck them, right? Yeah, yeah it, it really is kind of unfair. Yeah, it's completely unfair. The only way I could see is I see already the PS4 on a massive price cut. Saying two hundred fifty dollars, and at one. least, at least for a limited time, allow us to get some I, I, I definitely good see amount as an exchange for it. The thing is, the I console. already see this PS4 on a massive price cut, and it's gonna be like two hundred fifty dollars, I say, and the Neo, I guess, four hundred dollars. You know what I don't get? Maybe with it? a bundle with the VR. No, they already announced it. I'm pretty sure that's gonna be five hundred. How long? Okay, more. the. I don't. Okay, the Xbox 360 was out for ten years in total, right? Right. How long did it take before they got the Slim out? I think it took around like six or seven years, and then the last three years, the Slim was out on sale. And the Slim, the there, there was a Slim version, and they released another Slim version with the Xbox One type yeah. design. Exactly. Which is and then, pretty sad. Yeah. And then uh, for Sony, when Sony went through the whole uh, inside clock issue with the PS3, yep. they remodeled the whole thing and made uh, and made the Slim. But that one came, what, like three or four years after it was released? Yeah, it, it with the it, PS2, it, too. It, it oh. can't, no, no. The PlayStation Fat, the PlayStation 3 Fat, uh, came with the backwards compatible PlayStation One, PlayStation Two, yeah. and the slim version only had the PlayStation One. I mean, PlayStation Two made the slim version of. PlayStation oh yeah, 2. the PlayStation Two. Yeah, but the thing is that the PlayStation Two came out. Uh, it was on two thousand, and the slim version was in two thousand three and four, something like that. For three, four yeah. years. Place uh, PlayStation Three. I think it was two thousand nine, two thousand ten. Already with the one hundred twenty gigabyte. Or 150, uh, 120, I think it is. Uh, hard drive. So for PlayStation 4, uh, it's just stupid. I don't, I don't think. You know, it, it just upgrade. They're just doing that for the VR. Uh, why can't you just hold that for PlayStation 5? For if you think you're gonna put some 4K stuff, and I don't want to even think about, you know, the power like changing. Uh, you know, for the PlayStation, all right. If they're gonna show this new PlayStation and they're gonna sell it, which is uh, again higher processing power and all that stuff, I don't want the games being made cer a certain way. Oh, for that console, yeah, only. for that. Not 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 just exclusive for that console, oh, but you remember how this sees is, but here on this PlayStation Four looks ten times better. I don't want that shit. Yeah. I would just, yeah. I would just piss off. People don't do that shit. Completely. That would just fucking dick. And they're doing right. They're doing good. That would just, just kill himself, right yep. there. That's just uh, market suicide, completely. And PC Master Race wins. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> so, any other companies that you think they're gonna? Well, show we're forgetting about one game. Which is. My list, motherfucker. 
Shame you three. Oh my god. Yo, list. <laughs> that's uh, that's list. my that's mine. <laughs> I'll list one game. Uh, shame shame you three. Uh, I, I think that's a, that's gonna be a Sega thing. Uh, they're gonna show. Uh, I don't know. Maybe on. Sega doesn't have a press conference. Don't. <laughs> what the fuck. Dude, but. It doesn't matter because they can just go to a Sony conference or just a Microsoft conference and they should. Either they way, hijack another one. Either way, it's it Sony's. Yeah, totally. it's, a, <laughs> it's a studio, so completely, it's like Capcom. But Capcom Sony is to... helping. Sony helped them with something, but they have nothing to do with Shame You Three, because uh, apparently, and oh, here's another thing. Maybe Carlos, you're interest, uh, maybe interested on this. Um. Shame you wanted to remaster? Maybe. Port? Well, HD no, port? They, they're not good. They said they're not They're looking for that. people. Oh, they say they're looking for people. For Yeah, but they guys. said that they're not going to do that, though. What's up? Breaking news? I wanna ask you, I'm going to ask you this in both seriousness and jokes, okay? Is this a breaking news? No, no, it's not a breaking news. It's something that I remember that got shown recently, and it should have been shown and released a while ago. No, oh, God. Okay. And it is scary how it's ending up. Okay. So I'm gonna ask you this: You know how Sony and Microsoft kind of like split which other games are gonna show from different companies? Okay. So which one of these two is gonna show the disaster that is Mighty Number no. Nine? Oh Fuck God. Mighty Number no. Nine! <laughs> I am fucking fed up with that shit. Which I one? Of, which one of these two care. is gonna show the disaster that I I'm honestly making? could care less. <laughs> Fuck night, Mighty Number no. Nine. They should have released that shit a long time ago. Fuck two the years multiplayer. Ago. Yeah, two years ago, to be exact. That shit should have been released last year, to be honest. I don't care about leaderboards or fucking multiplayer. You can just add that up on an update later on. Fuck that game. Yes. I really Embrace don't your anger. care about Mighty Number no. Nine. I it's like the Last Guardian. One more delay, I'm fuck you. I really don't care. I honestly don't care anymore about Last Guardian if that happens. But for Mighty Number no. Nine, fuck you. Fuck you, man. <laughs> fuck that. And I don't think. Uh, oh, you know what would be funny? Capcom showing that. Huh? <laughs> oh, man. Uh, so, Mega Man, that Mega Man animated series. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably gonna be as bad as a Beast of Pac-Man one. I ra I ra you know, I'd rather watch a Mega Man series right now before they it release a Mighty Number no. 9. <laughs> it, may, it made me hurt, considering that one of my favorite cartoons in my childhood was a uh, Mega Man XC. Like, with Battle Network. Uh, yes! Battle, oh, God. Battle Network, that small special they did for Star Force. It's like, what happened? <laughs> why you why you do this? So so uh I really don't care about Paragon either. Uh they already released it. I yeah. I, I honestly don't care about Paragon. I was just a <laughs> fuck up when they drawn to it. death. Oh yes, that's one game that I'm waiting for. Yeah, like, fucking the creator of Twisted you take, Metal. They taking way too much time with that. Way too much. I don't know what they're adding. <laughs> but it's just the thing about Drawn to that they haven't shown anything else. Well, last year they just showed a little game. Exa demo. Exactly, but that was last year. They haven't They're shown still anything working else. On it. Uh, XCOM 2, they said they they, they, were on, they it got announced for consoles. Fuck yes. That That is amazing. Uh, that is amazing. Yeah. I'm very happy about that. Agents of Me. You know, now that you say this, there was, I think it was GameSpot had an accident recently. Say what? What? I think GameSpot had an accident recently. How uh, they were gonna talk about uh, XCOM 2. All right. But the video, the video they uploaded, I think it was an Overwatch video, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, it it was like, oh, XCOM 2 has been confirmed, and then you, you have this Overwatch video. It's like, what? Womp womp. <laughs> God damn it! Know. But yeah, uh, it, that might my day a few days ago. <laughs> They did good. No way, the other thing. <laughs> for it, all right, for Sony. Uh, uh, another thing about Sony, Last of Us Two. Mm. Mm. Be interesting, actually. I'm it down. I, I don't. It I, will break I, the internet. I I, 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 I sure doubt it. I, you know, I doubt it in one way. 
but it would be fucking awesome if there they is... teased it. Oh, uh, you know, at the end. Of I'd Sony. steal a PlayStation for it. Crash Bandicoot. <gasps> I'm keeping don't it alive. Even pl don't, uh, don't I, I want to keep it alive. Yes. Crash Bandicoot. I'm hopeful for yes. that game. Imagine that if, motherfucker comes out if, with a t-shirt again with Crash Bandicoot. If fuck you, it, Sean, if, if you have. They do it. <laughs> I He's gonna will do it. He's steal gonna do a it. PlayStation. Hear me now, police of Puerto Rico. I will steal. They're not gonna do anything. They don't care. <laughs> That's exactly why I'm telling them. <laughs> unless you talk, uh, unless you talk with. I'm one worried, of the, uh... Victor. How long have you been recording for? Oh, uh, 55 minutes. Oh, it's actually not that long. This is a special podcast. Uh, yeah, it's okay, we're just enjoying our time. Have you been too quiet? For hey, it? E3 predictions on 30 minutes. That's impossible. Yeah. That's impossible. So... Last and but not least, Agents of Mayhem. Oh, that, that uh, that, that game that, that Saints Row cop out. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> so I, you know, I I haven't seen much of Agents of. Me. It looks interesting. I think they're gonna try to compete with uh, Overwatch. You think so? It Did looks you like Battleborn that. tried. Yeah, battle. Uh, <laughs> poor Battleborn. Battle what? <laughs> poor Battleborn. I think you're saying Battlefield because I don't know another battle. Poor Battleborn. That, that game was it's so bad for you should have delayed, man. You should have delayed. You should have delayed. delayed. You should, your, your game should have been faster. Period. You should have pulled out. Period. Yeah. Oh, another oh. game that's trying to compete with Overwatch. You should have pulled out. God damn it. Lawbreakers. <laughs> you you, you should have pulled out, but you fucking nutted. Nope. We're going to release it the same time as Overwatch. We're going to show them what we got. <laughs> so We ain't got money. <laughs> we ain't got money. <laughs> we did board ads, guys. Come on. Um, what else? I, I don't think there's uh, nothing else for Sony. Uh, I'm pretty oh. sure because we're talking about the Sony conference, what they might bring. Uh, we already talked about uh, Horizon Zero Dawn. Um, I don't see anything about Killzone. On no. the yeah. Horizon Zero Dawn. It's the same company. Uh, no, because you can. Uh, Guerrilla Games made Killzone Shadow shit. But and three, yeah. But another person. Oh wait, I'm forgetting about something. That new God of War that they uh, announced. They announced. Do you think they're gonna show a trailer? I don't see a, a fucking name oh, God of War it. four. I don't see that number. So do you think like? And the thing is that everything with this God of War is gonna be with Norse uh, mythology. So they do be, that. So it's gonna be fucking Thor, um, Odin. It really does sound interesting. Yeah, it would be pretty, pretty fucking cool. Uh, but yeah, God of War. I don't, I don't see the number four. Oh, we forgot all. about the VR. PlayStation VR. Uh, some titles. Fucking. Sadly, I, wanna, I think it's gonna. I, be cool. I, I, I want to know about that kitchen game. That fucking kitchen game. I want to know more. Why? Because I want to. Because he him. wants to learn to cook. God no, damn it! No, no, it's it's not what you think, Evan, at all. It's it's not about cooking at all. You're gonna shit. Oh. You, you're gonna cook up shit on your pants. So, <laughs> so I want to know about more about that game. I uh, I can definitely see that release, uh, releasing Res Infinite there. Um, what else? Uh. You think they're gonna show that? What was that one release for the HTC Vive and Oculus Rift? That it would, that it's Which like a one? space, a, a space shooter. Space. Um, oh, the one that we saw. With no. I forgot that name. God damn it. Yeah, that one. That's no, uh, no, that's that's a uh, exclusive for them. God damn it. Fuck. <laughs> We're not gonna get none of those HTC Vive. They said <laughs> that it's gonna be compatible if we do some stuff in the computer. No, but uh, for VR, uh, I see a shitload of titles, but I don't think it's gonna be all. If they if they take the whole press conference on VR, I'm gonna be pissed. But they need to market that. They need to fucking they need advertise to market that. that. Yeah, they need so to So they're probably gonna take like half that at all. Yeah, fuck. All right. Um. <laughs> so moving on to Nintendo. and one thing, what? Sony, please. Don't give too much time to fucking Call of Duty, please. Don't give too much time. We hate the game. Don't you uh, understand? No. Here, here's something. Here's something. Uh, you're forgetting something, Cardos. Sony, please. Uh, give so, us Sony good... is now that the house of... 
Oh, dude. S so, so, Sony, please, can you give us better titles for PlayStation Plus? Please. I would appreciate it. May they all surprise us. <laughs> I'd appreciate it. If they, you, I don't know if you, if you, NBA <laughs> motherfucker. But hey, you gotta admit that that is a good. Um, you gotta admit that is a good title. That is a good title for yeah. for that sport for the sports fans. And now and now even now that you know we're in the what in the playoffs. Piece of shit. Hey, I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just fucking saying. Uh, you're to it's not so working, Nintendo. Nintendo. Let's move on. Okay. Yes. So Nintendo yeah. never shows up in person okay. unless they're going to show a console like they did when the Wii U was going to come. Uh huh. If they show up in person, they could still do the digital event regardless. Okay. I want to see the NX or at least the blueprints for it. I want to see something about it since you already told me it's coming out next year. You're already going to show me Zelda. Okay, fine. Show me and tell me already, hey, it's actually going to come out with the NX. And there is going to be a Wii U version, how they did with uh, Twilight Princess when the Wii was coming out. Don't spend your time telling me about games that I already know are going to come out. Tell me about games that I don't know are going to come out. And please, for the love of Christ, please, for the love of Christ, for the love of everything that's holy, and for the love of your, sadly, that president, bring some F-Zero, bring... Something that isn't Metroid Federation Force. Oh, God. Oh. Bring the real good things. Bring me things that will make me it's... not regret buying my Wii U just for Pokemon. How about no IP? The swear to God. Yo, how about more Tokyo <coughs> Mirage sessions? Hashtag FE gameplay. <laughs> I already know you, what's you, about no, it. You could show me a bit more gameplay aside from the, uh, the little things that you've been doing lately. Of giving me like like the set of rules and whatnot. But... <laughs> Oh, that's another thing. Fire, uh, uh, Fire Emblem became a, a major title for them this year. Like, after how well uh, Conquest and Birthright did, they officially gave it the seal of approval of being a staple game for them. So it'll probably show us something else that they plan on doing with that. Um, I just want to feel the fact that, okay, you are supporting indie games, which one of them I actually got got it a while back, which was Portal Space Adventures. It was beautiful and difficult. But if you're going to support indie games, make it a really big thing. Don't just show me two seconds of them. Take a few of them, put them up as your big deal if this is the focus that you want to, to, to give. you know, don't Just show me Mario. Don't just show me all these games that you already have. Show me new stuff. New IPs, new things. Show me that since now you have a different... Uh, president and he's taking this whole other move and this other thing, show me that there really is a difference in the company. You know what? Oh, even and, though, uh, even, even though the, the censoring team. It, it, you, know, you know, for for Nintendo, they, even though they're going to talk about Zelda, that's the only thing they're going to talk about. Yep. And no, actually, they, they confirmed that they're going to add more things to the roster. As, as in for, like, Pokemon and stuff? Yeah, like uh, after they showed the recent uh, Pokemon Sun and Moon news, they mentioned that they were going to show more uh, like extra games aside from just Zelda. Zelda is still going to be the main thing. That's going to be their, ma their main selling baby. So I wouldn't be surprised if obviously, they're obviously digital. Obviously, they're going to show NX at all. That's for <laughs> later. That's for a later. I think, I think for the S guys, come on. Yeah. Like th there is a really big reason why they should show the, uh, the NX now. And it's the fact that even though, yes, it's America, and I'm not saying it because it's just America, but E3 is the biggest selling point for anything video game related. Yep. It is. You not showing this console that you're promising for March, which, newsflash, this is already June. This is half point, half point this year. You only have six months left. You gotta build the hype. Exactly. You have to start building the hype now. That's why I'm telling you, when you showed the Wii U, what did you show? You showed the Wii U, you showed future titles that you were promising that you didn't really release, you showed third-party titles that, well, sadly failed at the beginning, and you showed many games and features for the Wii U. You took about 10 to 20 minutes to show me the new console. You have a digital event that lasts between 
30 to 40, 50 minutes tops. That's how you normally do it. I'm calling it. I'm calling it, Jose. Yeah. The, we, uh, the Nintendo NX is getting delayed. Again. I'm calling it now. I wouldn't be surprised if it gets delayed. And if it does, it's a good thing. The NX is coming out way too soon. It is probably the soonest console that has come out in history. Because it got announced two years cards. ago. It got announced two years ago on a December. No, it's not just two years ago. How long has the Wii U been around? It's only been around for what, four years? Yeah, and yeah. apparently they're gonna keep. Uh, they're gonna yeah. keep supporting it. You know, you know what else they were gonna keep supporting and, and completely gave up on it? The GameCube. Shut up. That's, that's <laughs> fucked up. Shut up. That's you know, keep in keep in mind this is no longer the big three. This is the this is the dynamic duo and a new member to the, to their roster. I. It's, it's just we they... don't we don't know how things are going to run from here on out. I don't, I don't, I definitely see the NX getting delayed once again. Uh, I don't know, for a fall release, winter release, you know, and hear me out. Mm -hmm. It's get, gets delayed for winter 2017. Which would be fine. And Legend of Zelda gets delayed once again. Because no. I, I'm, I'm saying it, I've been saying it ever since. When Zelda got announced, the, it, the the those the, the things were start the announcement of this console started going on uh, around on summer 2014 and they showed Legend of Zelda uh, <coughs> the new the new Zelda U or whatever yep. the name is people uh, calling it Zelda U for now uh, for you uh, for now Zelda U I'm pretty sure they're gonna release the full name on this uh, Nintendo Direct so they've been m delaying that game f multiple times. And I say this game is just meant for that, uh, for the fucking uh, release. New console. Yeah, for the launch. Uh, it wants to be a launch, launch title. title. Yeah. Completely a fucking launch title. I've been saying that. I was like, that game is gonna come out for the NX. It's gonna come out for the Wii U simultaneously. I just don't want that bonus content. It's on NX, and the uh, you know the game itself. It it runs lower on the Wii U. But I can definitely see that, man. I could definitely see that game being released with the NX on launch. I don't think it's going to be released first on Wii U, and then it's going to come out with the NX. No, it's going to be released it could, simultaneously. It could be a possibility. I, I, I am still willing to bet on that possibility. It, Again. Like, they, they could literally go, hey, take the game so you stop complaining. And then later on, go like, hey, you remember that game you really, really wanted? Here, have it again with more shit. I don't know. I just that's just I don't know. It just simply uh, seems unfair. A new DS. No, no, they won't. not at all, not at all. They, Fuck no. For they, 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 for they DS. have they have no more need for a. They have DS. to stop. This needs to stop now. <laughs> no, for, but four K DS. Oh, shut the fuck up, Nintendo. <laughs> shut Do you believe? <laughs> you will. <laughs> <laughs> but no, no, no. A new DS is just way off at all. The, yeah, yeah no, fuck, no, no, hell no. Stop with the mobile. So. Um, yeah, they, they just released this game, Mitomo, for the this app. Uh, I don't know about it. Oh, they're they're something. releasing two more apps actually. Oh, so really? I'm, pre I'm pretty sure they're gonna talk about that more. On They'll the probably yeah. They're releasing a Fire Emblem game for the for the mo for the phones. And they're releasing an Animal Crossing game similar to Mitomo. Mitomo. Huh. Okay. Yeah. They they had talked about this, uh, I think it was back in April, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. Yeah. So it is a possibility. Yeah. You know, again, yeah. like I said, NX being delayed for fall, winter release with Legend of Zelda. Maybe uh, helping you out, Jose, with a F Zero game for mm -hmm. a secret F Zero game. Um, another Metroid game, please. Another, another fucking Star Give me Hunters Two. I don't. I don't Star care. If Hunters was not that well acclaimed. Give me Hunters Two. <laughs> oh, uh, I'm pretty sure they're gonna show more about Monster Hunter Generations. Ooh. They'll probably show generations and maybe confirm stories for the West because they've been kind of considering keeping stories as a Jap Japanese exclusive. Yeah. But the fact that they're releasing 
three amiibos for that game, it's a possibility that they might move it to the West just to get more sales. Okay. Yeah, by the so? way, the amiibos for that the amiibos for that game look beautiful. They're a little bigger than what we're used to receiving for thirteen bucks. Disney Infinity. <laughs> 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 uh, that is a shame. That, that, get, that, a that game shame. had potential. They should have just made it more immersive. Really, they yeah. they should have given you more for for what the uh, for what you were paying for. So PC gaming, not another shit show. It's well, I mean, no, 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 because they're showing Civ. They're showing Civilization Six. Yeah, yeah that, um, that is definitely but, something. But I'm you waiting. can just do that separate. I don't know about PC. It's just the show. It, as, as a whole, was bad. Okay. Yeah, I, I, but hey, I mean, oh, hey oh, you I know what? You... I, you know what? You know what? I'm not gonna give too much shit, cause hey, it's the first time they did it, and maybe this one they'll learn from their mistakes. Exactly. You know, maybe maybe they'll I'll give it a shot. I'll give it a shot again. Uh, if Gabe New, releases. if Gabe Newell comes out, oh. I'll just piss myself. Yep. <laughs> most likely. But yeah, uh, PC, there's nothing more uh, for PC gaming show. Uh, you know, conference. Rising Storm Two, Civilization. Uh, yeah, most likely. That's it. Uh, and I, I just, for the love of fucking god, do not show me about this cool ass fucking keyboards. Don't show me. They're fucking... gonna do it. It's PC. Oh my god! Hey. No, please, God, no. This this is so the conceited little boys platform? can jerk off and be happy. Whatever. Uh, I, I don't know. I don't know. So you know, going for this last uh, last segment. Here comes the predictions of what you think it's gonna get announced, but it's not on your list. Maybe it's on your <coughs> list. Here comes. Hear me out. Name game. Name a game that you think it's way off. Way off. Example: Half Life Three. That you think it's gonna be really uh, announced or released or yeah, trailer. So basically, something you're dreaming of that you want. Pretty that. much. Left 4 Dead 3. And of course, of course, that's, that's it's the it's same dr- thing, eh, but, but it's I uh, want Valve to learn three. But they the must thing is, count. They're, Evan, they're gonna Evan, do a two and a half or something. It, it, all right, like that. to to balance it out, it's dreams, your dreams, but at the same time, what you think from other other studios that it's gonna be uh, announced or shown. Other Tekken, than Tekken, Valve. Tekken Seven, I see that on Sony, completely Maybe. being shown. Um, maybe a release date for mm. consoles already. Uh, Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> That's not gonna happen. Uh, Last of Us Two. I see that. I see that. You know what? I see that for PlayStation Experience. I see a teaser. Definitely. Uncharted spinoff. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. The fuck That's up. just stupid. But uh, maybe maybe a DLC. You know maybe maybe a DLC story uh, teaser. Who knows? What do you think, Jose? Mm. What do you, what do you have? For what? For a prediction <laughs> that what do you think <laughs> is gonna be shown? Would you even or hear yes, you little shit? Eight. No, I you... my brain passed up for a second, I'm sorry. Uh... No, yes. Yeah, How unfortunate that was just a second. Yeah. Okay, well. Leave a like and no, subscribe, re- re- guys. For me. <laughs> really you want me to repeat where, myself? Where so, Jose. Yeah. We are talking about predictions that it's just way off, way over the top. Yeah. Maybe dreams that come true, okay. and okay. things that you th- you think it's gonna be actually you know y- you see a possibility of actually happening. Uh, like I said, Tekken Seven. Uh, it's a game that's been an arcade in Japan for many 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 months, and they talked mm-hmm. about a console edition, and they say they have problems, but I can see I definitely can see a trailer for it, mm-hmm. uh, maybe a release date. Mm-hmm. So. Okay. And the exaggeration you... and the exaggeration for dreams. I'm talking about Half Life Three. <laughs> That's never good. Okay. Happen. Oh, wasn't there? Okay, I'm gonna give you two that have been talked as possibilities of things that can be shown between this year and the next. Yeah. And I'm gonna give you one that I see no possibility of it ever happening, but if it does, holy shit. What do you think? Okay. So the two possibilities that I kind of want. Uh, is the fact that they talked about possibly Left 4 Dead 3 hmm. and Darksiders 3. Those are my two main wants of things that I know no, maybe uh, won't happen, but I'd be really happy if it's solved. The thing that might make me a little more ecstatic, considering it's a small thing from my childhood, and I got the chance to play it again uh, a few months back at a friend's house, 
is if for whatever reason they decide to revive the War of the Monsters series and make a sequel to that game. You. Ooh. Yes. Yes. They do that, considering the Nintendo. fact that they made it. Nintendo, please do it. No, that's not a Nintendo thing, that's a Sony thing. And Sony recently, when they started their PlayStation 2 backwards compatibility, that was the first game added into uh, the list of games that you can buy for 10 bucks. Hmm. Pretty good. So that's why I'm stating, if you put it up, it's probably because you want people to learn about this game, and if you want people to learn about the game, it's because you're maybe thinking of making a sequel for it. And if you do, hey, I might actually buy a PS4. So, Fuck yeah. You should have done that a long time ago. Yeah. I should not. I have, I have no more space for consoles in this room. I just don't have the money. <laughs> I, sh- I just don't have the money. <laughs> if I did, I'd have all consoles. Yes, very happy. Mafia 3. We're gonna show more. Oh, we we, we forgot about that game. <laughs> yeah, that's we, why. We're, uh, that, like, that game is still a thing? Yeah. And now that I saw that tra- new trailer and yeah, they said that Beetle Skelet is gonna be, like, convinced- it's gonna be there, god damn it. <laughs> god fucking damn You're it. You're the hype train, Victor. Damn it. <laughs> Um. Yeah. The bias. Evan, what are you expecting for me three? What am I expecting? Hmm. And you, Carlos, what are you expecting? Ah. It can be anything, right? Expecting impossible yeah, is anything. very difficult for me. It could be anything. <laughs> Just it could be over the top. Well, my, we may like fucking laugh. I already mentioned it, but a left for did three. That would be amazing for me. Everybody's with the three. Something God, beautiful. Something be- just Something no. Anything Valve, bad. anything Valve has that they don't want to count to three. I want it out of three. Now, <laughs> now, I want it now. But other than that, I really don't know. I, uh, I really want to see more Star Wars titles. I the thing, really want to see the more. The fucking thing about that man is fucking EA. EA has the rights for Star Wars games. God, yeah. Exactly. That's what fucking. That's what's choking me right here. I mean, why out of all the companies in the world did you give EA? Disney spent did you give it to EA? Because do- Disney spent four billion dollars. I need to. They need to think. Oh, what company can make money out of a game and just fuck the people? Oh. I know. Da, 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 da. Then you see fucking building of EA Electronic Arts. EA it's like, game. oh, I knew. God, it. everything. Shut the, shut the fuck. Now, now you said that. Now I want to fucking play Nightfire James Bond game. Fuck you. Yeah. EA game. Nightfire. <laughs> <laughs> so, any other, any other announcement? Uh... You know, I talked about maybe yeah, 2K. Uh, another. Hey, Telltale Games. Telltale games. No, no more Telltale games. T- fucking Telltale games showing more okay, about okay. the Batman. How about this Breaking <laughs> Bad Telltale game? Shut the fuck up. Yo, <laughs> wait, wait, whoa. The Legend of Jesse. Ooh, yeah. Okay, you, okay. You know, I was gonna give you a shot, but you done fucked it up. What? <laughs> I was gonna give you a shot. <laughs> oh, what? Who, who's the Legend of Jesse? I Walter was White gonna give dead? you a shot. <laughs> And you done fucked it up. You I was stabbed like, it in the I, I was like, I was like, wait, yeah, Cardo may be up to uh, the legend of Jesse Pink. Uh, fuck you, man. <laughs> <laughs> Who's gonna be the legend of Walter Jr.? Yeah. Maybe. Yes. Who knows? Fucking breakfast yes. all day, every day. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you, man. But what's for breakfast? Beat them with a crutch. Oh my god. But uh, Telltale Games. He's a great actor. I don't have. He's a. I like him as an actor. <laughs> Hey, maybe, who knows, a fucking mobile game of Breaking Bad, just throwing a pizza on the roof, uh, on the top of the fucking house. <laughs> I bet that's a game already. Who don't fucking... That <laughs> is a game already in Newgrounds, motherfucker. Are you serious? <laughs> oh, what? No, I, no, I bet there's a game in Newgrounds about that. That would I'm fucking go. Cool. That would I'm fucking go. Cool. Newgrounds That'd makes a game cool. out of everything. Alright, uh, this, this is one thing that I want from EA. The one thing. Just one. And... I'm pretty sure Jose and Evan's gonna agree with okay, me. Okay, I, I have my, my dream though. Okay, for me. Battlefield 2021. Shut the fuck up. I mean, <laughs> please. Star Wars, Star Wars, The Old Republic. Ports yes, and fuck yes. You're please, por favor, señor, haga lo posible. No, that's not. Translation, God. please, God, make it possible. I think Star God. Wars, <laughs> The Savage. Old Republic. Public on fucking consoles. Hey, we have DC Universe Online. We have what? What else? 
on fucking play so consoles. Basically, basically, you're asking EA to unscrew themselves. Yes, sir. Because that's what happened when that game came out. They, that's what <laughs> they we always want them to do, to unscrew themselves, but they never do. Why? Because they love us. that screw. They love that screw. No, they tight, screw us. Deep in their anuses. So deep, it scratches the back of their cranium. Oh, they can feel the screw touching the brain. Stop. Breaking it. Stop. <laughs> stop. <laughs> Please stop. Please stop. <laughs> okay. Stop just saying. Stop. Just saying. Just saying, Vic. Vic. Yes. Put a screw on the image. God damn it. <laughs> Fucking, I'm gonna put a screw on EA logo. That's what exactly I'm Yay! gonna do. Yay! So, right up the bum. So, another another one. Another one. And f please, EA. Don't screw it up. No, please, EA. Way up. If you put BioWare to do it. If you put BioWare. If you put BioWare. To make another Knights of Old Republic game. Just for the fucking console. Not the Old Republic ported. No, another Knights of the Old Republic game. That would be fucking amazing. If they do that. But the thing is, it's not going to happen. No, no, but if they do that. It's a big if. But if they do that. What, will, you, will they earn your respect again? What? Would they res... Uh, well, I, th I have more respect for EA than Yubi should. Oh, geez. Anybody at this point has more respect for EA. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Pretty much. Because the thing is, I know I'm going to get fucked in the ass by EA. But, but there's a actually, semblance yeah. of quality. But Ubisoft lies <laughs> with their product. You know at least lies? I Sony. know. Uh, Sony, you know, the thing about Sony is that it's going to come out. Yeah, but we haven't said when it's going to come out. Yep. As as fucking Square Enix, uh, I think releasing a trailer for Final Fantasy VII Remake was a mistake. No, no. Was a mistake. You know what? Was a mistake. Because that game Square... is not even it's not even worked on. To be honest, I don't think it's gonna be <coughs> even worked on. No, actually, look. It's gonna be a glitch. Plus. What what titles is okay? Square is working right now on, on Final Fantasy VII, Kingdom Hearts Three. And Final finishing 15. 15 Final Fantasy 15 plus support. Final Fantasy Worlds too. You forget about that one too. Yeah, yeah. They're they're also working on Worlds, which they released another trailer recently. 2.8 Kingdom fucking Hearts. Awesome. 2.8 Kingdom, Kingdom Hearts, Kingdom Hearts. 2.8, which gets released at the end of this year. Near the next Near game. Exit. Just finish Great Kingdom Hearts working. three for fuck's sakes. That's a completely different. You know, you know what's the problem? Why Kingdom Hearts three hasn't been finished? Because they they need to finish fifteen because the team that works on fifteen is the team that works on Kingdom Hearts. But they're throwing other titles into that too, like fucking. Yeah, but it's not. But it's not the same team. When do you see? Do, do you see fucking Kingdom Hearts three being shown here? No. Yes. Fuck yes. no. I don't know. No, maybe. Don't fucking. Know. Maybe, but if it is shown, it'll be more of a tease than an actual uh, showing of the, the game. It's probably the same bullshit that they showed us last time. A fucking yeah, Japanese we'll, version. No, more polished. They've had they've had two more trailers in the time between last E3 and this. This E3. Yeah, was so the Tokyo Game Show. That's a whole year. They yeah they they had one for Tokyo Game Show yeah. and they had one for D23, which was the uh, Disney conference a while back. And both trailers, both trailers, were pretty similar, but at the same time, added more to it. Like Car they added a few more things. To Carlos the asked me, textures maybe. <laughs> Carlos asked me. Texture. Then, Texture sort of what of percentage do you, I think Kingdom Hearts Three is at? I say it's on a thirty percent. I think it's. 40. I say I say it's at a twenty. You know what? I'm agree. <laughs> 20%. No, it's, it's I, at a 20. I go with 20, 20 maybe 18. It's at a 20, and I understand why. That's Victor, disagree with Carlos. Victor, huh? you know, you know the, 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 the trailer I showed you, right? Earlier. Yeah. The yeah. one for 2.8 yep. and the rest yep. of it? Okay. That trailer, the bits for Birth by Sleep Volume 2, and the cutscenes for Unchained, Back. Yeah. both of those were made in Unreal 4. This is the first time that Disney Interactive Studios and Square are not using their own engine for one of their games. 
is using another one. They're using a completely new engine for their game. I am so so far liking it because surprisingly, uh, both of the both the Birth by Sleep Volume Two and Unchained look incredibly beautiful. Something that you would something that you would think, considering how cartoony Kingdom Hearts actually is, you would think it would look kind of weird. It actually looks really really nice. Yeah, it it actually does. It does. Yeah, I could I could agree. Yeah, it fucking li it's just the lighting so, effects from the them part uh, the lighting and particle effects are just the yeah. most awesome thing from Unreal. It, it, yeah, it, and it honestly, is. when it comes to the modeling, which is what will show the, the you know the entire body of it, uh, in Unreal it's an entire empty landscape, so you really can't play with the modeling, and that's why it shouldn't really affect if it looks cartoony or not. So that's that's actually one of the good things I like yeah. about it. Game is gonna look beautiful. But when yeah, no, do no I see? About that. When no do I see that. Kingdom Hearts three being released? I say 2019, 2018, 2019. Uh, 2018. 2018 as a as oh. like a extended limit. 2017 as their possibility. No, 2017 is nah, not gonna happen. It, 2017 if they rush it, which would be a very no. fucking mistake. 2018, early 2018. That's what I'm calling. No, I say 2017. Early 2018, <laughs> I say 2017 because of how split the games have been lately. Like, even though people don't like to consider the spin-offs, if you want to put it that way, uh, as part of the main story, each one of those games has a three to four year uh, time span in between. And Kingdom Hearts 3 got shown. I believe it was either 2015 or 2014, somewhere around. No, it, it got teased 2014, it got shown 2015, and it's continued being shown. This is the third year. So it's either getting released next year or the year after. All right. Yeah. I just hope they haven't done it so far. I really don't hope. I really hope that they don't go with that. That the game is actually complete as all the others, and it doesn't require any DLC or anything aesthetic on the side. Like I really See, hope I you don't say, have to Kingdom Hearts Three, 2018, and Final Fantasy VII Remake. Pff, I fucking don't know. I see that. <laughs> I see that 2019, 2020. It's just uh, they. I, I'm pretty sure they're they're not even working on it. No, they're finishing 15. They're they're finishing everything else that they have to finish. Yeah. Yeah, but the thing is, uh, said, Final, Fantasy, why... uh, Final Fantasy VII, they're working on it as uh, episodes, right? Yeah. They could be. Re they could release the episodes yearly. They could, That's not a bad they, idea. I don't, For $60, because fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they, okay, yeah. I mean, but, I mean, they could actually release it yearly, and that way they can keep us, you know, entertained with the title, and then bring up the other half, but it's gonna... <laughs> It's gonna kind of break the immersion for the players when you actually do get the full package. No, you so know. I guess you can just run it completely and not be a bitch about it. Square tested their episodic formula when they made Life is Strange, and when Life is Strange was released first, it was released for how much? I think it was like twenty bucks. Yep. And then they kept adding everything else, uh, either for like a really small price or for free. One of the two, I don't really remember. So they could just give us the full price, they, and they give the other ones. Who is having problems? Who is having nasal kind of problems right now? Nasal? I thought they were cutting <laughs> fucking wood or something. <laughs> they could. What they could do is, and hear me out. You're gonna release an episodic. Release the first episode for twenty. I don't really mind you releasing the first episode for twenty. Every other expansion to that story is ten bucks, and at the end of it all, if the price is over sixty. You can make the same. You can do the same thing you did with Life is Strange, which is release the whole season or the whole game for the full sixty at the end. Like if you really don't want to pay uh, everything by bits, then just buy the game at the end. They can just do what Hitman's game. doing with their with their game. Not be good. Episodes. Oh, <laughs> man. I said that from the beginning. The Hitman game being released episodic. It's just retarded. no. It's a stupid idea. It's but... stupid. Hey, Victor. What? Possibility of them teasing another Tomb Raider. No, you know what? I, uh -huh. I was thinking about the release date for a Tomb Raider: The Rise of the Tomb Raider on PS4. 
it's, it still hasn't been released. Been released? Uh, nope, that's uh, that serious? was a that was a one year. Oh my exclusive. god, I didn't know that. Am be <laughs> killing herself? No, not oh, really. Played it. Uh, not, okay, not really. good. Just no, not, not really. really. No, I haven't played it still, but uh, I haven't played really. it either. Not I lent it to you. What the I fuck? know, but I haven't what? touched it because Uncharted Four happened. Oh, oh okay, come on! But th then pass it over here. I can't play Uncharted, so at least let me. <laughs> you faggot, <laughs> Victor! Oh, you shit! Tomb let, me play, let me play Tomb Raider without boobs. Uh, Jesus. <laughs> uh, that's, cor that's very correct. Care. That is very correct. How different the story There is are. no <laughs> bouncing <laughs> animation. That is wrong. <laughs> It, it's Tomb just, I, I love, I, I, I don't see the similarities, I don't know. No, nope. I can't compare. I mean, oh, 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 I can compare, no, it. I can compare totally but I can it. definitely say that Uncharted has a superior story. Oh, completely. And the second game agree. wasn't that good, either way. I didn't like it. I, I haven't played uh, Rise of the Tomb Raider, but uh, the, Microsoft said it, that like, it was a one year exclusive deal. Yep. They're probably gonna in, announce which, something in which, freaky. in which, you know, I'm just saying this, you know, maybe being an anal analyst, but uh, releasing it only for the Xbox One was a mistake. Oh yeah, completely. Well, yeah, they killed a lot of fans. No, no, definitely. not kill a lot of fans. The sale wasn't that good, and they yeah. haven't released a number. Exactly. That's, that's, that's a problem. A number. I find that that's because, a problem uh, with bringing the old titles back. The old titles, the community that played these old games, they divided. With the new consoles, uh, these new different consoles, they've everyone's divided. I mean, uh, there was uh, for Kingdom Hearts. There was a time that people were saying it was going to be a completely PlayStation exclusive, and everyone and that is coming up for Xbox. Oh well, yeah. And everyone that was on Xbox with my friends and shit, we were all like, "Well, we don't fucked up." Because we love the game, and not being able to play it because we got the wrong consoles. Like, well, I guess I could just kill myself. <laughs> but, <laughs> but uh, releasing a game a that was played by mostly everyone in the community for just one console exclusive, I find it's a really big dick move for the uh, towards the community because we all played it and we would like the chance to play it again. That's why when I see someone say, "Oh," They're bringing back this game. Oh, really? <coughs> yeah, it's PlayStation exclusive. I hate you. A lot. You, you want to... Hey, hey, Jose. Carlos, yeah. how much you want to bet I can trigger Evan right now? Go for it. $60. I'm betting against me. Kingdom Under Fire 2. <laughs> Fuck yeah. <laughs> Kingdom Under Fire. Fuck yeah, if they do that. Delayed. <laughs> if they do that. <laughs> if they do you're that. You're losing. All of your consoles. <laughs> oh my god. Keep and going. your hair. Oh yeah, one other <laughs> thing. Shit. One other thing. Another <laughs> thing. Another thing. Persona 5. Yeah, that oh, one. Yeah, exactly. I'll give you that one. Persona 5. I want I want that. I already pre-ordered my... I, <laughs> I don't know if I should pre-order the fucking collector's edition. No, you already did the Horizon one. It's okay. It's okay, Victor. You Fuck. have a whole year. It's February. You have a whole year to figure that out. Uh, right now, it's like uh, when Carlos right now. Fuck, Carlos right now said, <laughs> "Oh, it's February." Right, but fucking my head. <laughs> Horizon Zero done. February twenty eight. Persona five. February fourteen. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh fuck. <laughs> God damn. Choose. That's very easy. I can, I can roll a bank. I'll <laughs> take the rope. <laughs> oh, okay. I'll just play in heaven where it's free. A bullet solves everything, you know. Yeah, but you oh, must yeah. know how to here, use the bullet. Here at the rating pending show, we do not condone any of these actions. Anything yeah. I say or Evan say, Cardo say or Jose say, that's their deal, not ours. <laughs> Uh, I don't know about just, you. We, a joke. We do not condone if you can't take action. a joke, fuck you. <laughs> My name's not important. What the fuck are you doing here? That's You're in the internet, you know. This is basically joke central. Yeah. So. Hell, you're alive. Uh, I, 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 I don't think there's anything more. Save Arambe! Yeah, you don't. I am, I, I am so glad I'm Big Bird Lord. Thank you, please. Say what? No, nothing. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm gonna repeat this. Again. <laughs> 
Oh, this, is me, this is me recording, you dumbass. You might as well say it again. So the funny thing is, I'm gonna leave it like that, and I'm gonna see if Victor hears it when he's editing this whole video. Oh, it is. You know what? No, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna just put it. Say here. you're he's, gonna. Yeah. Okay, Victor's not gonna. Victor's not gonna catch it now. He's gonna call me later and tell me you piece of shit. Okay. Okay. Evan, you were saying that if you can't take a joke, that's how you get that. Like, get out. No, I said fuck you. Okay, it's pretty funny because it's exactly how we lost our member. Huh. Good. 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 Can't take the heat, don't play with fire. I don't know what Or do. About. We'll get rid of you. Okay. Yeah, me neither. Um, I really don't know. I'm just gonna leave it there. Don't worry about it. Uh, okay. Leave a like and subscribe, guys. So. Uh, without further ado, I think that's it for our predictions. We're gonna talk about uh, after E3, post E3 show, talking about basically whatever we, what everything happened on E3 and Sunday, yeah, Monday, and t Tuesday. What's up? But what if we just did one per day? We could. We could. We okay. could, and just uh, and keep shoot it ourselves cold. too. <laughs> We're doing, That's a possibility. we're doing one per day. I'm oh, come on, Carlos. You gotta get good sometime. It's called being responsible and on time, Carlos. Could be. So, um, oh, I'm announcing something. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna do another separate video of this. But Jose and I, we've been talking about this, and Evan knows. Carlos knows. I know. Uh, we what are I doing a giveaway. Oh, of we a are? specific yes, game, so. of a specific game, that I will tease and make a trailer out of that. Oh, you guys will love that. Um, it's a uh, it's a PlayStation Four game. Uh, that's the only thing I'm gonna say. Yeah. Hello, it's darkness, my old friend. But uh, Evan, you're snapping. Jose, yeah, Jose Carlos, Shut and up. Evan, <laughs> do you Stop like that? Hope. Do you like that giveaway? Yeah. I don't even remember it. I I feel like it's. <laughs> Wow. Yeah. Are you serious? Wow. wow. <laughs> How are you people surprised? Wow. <laughs> you bastards can play about me. Jose, you were saying something. Look at the chat. Oh. Look at the chat. Fuck. Oh. See, that's why I forgot about it. Wow. If you made it this far, nice. do me a favor. <laughs> Write in the comments and tell Victor, hey, we need to make this a video podcast. Because whenever I forget or Evan forgets something, our faces are just incredibly stupid when those happen. Oh, we will. Yep. Like, we will. Well, we like, have some content coming soon. Oh, yes. That's faces. another thing. We have, uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, that's true. Huh? Um, it's going to come out maybe, yeah, most likely next week when the E3 things are over. Huh? So, 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 Wait, so, 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 Soap. <laughs> Don't worry about a thing. My brain. But yeah, you know, let's do that. Let's do that video daily when E3 uh, keeps going. Let's do that. Oh yeah, I like it. So I'll prepare the gun. <sighs> fucking guy. <laughs> I love Without how further ado, video. thanks for li thanks for listening to the rating pending podcast show number forty something. <laughs> Wait, we're, we're at forty. We're at forty something. We should have 15. been at forty something a long time. Oh, wait, ago. No, we should have been at fifty something. We should have been a hundred yeah. something. But of course, we should have. But of course, of course, of course. You know, we should have been of responsible. So, 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 so. I know, right? So, so. responsible YouTubers. So, um, thanks for listening to this episode. I was your host, Victor. There, give us a like on facebookcom slash the rating pending show and on youtube.com slash the rating pending show give us a like share with your friends comment what do you think what's gonna be on the e3 give us your predictions i want to hear it i want to i want to read it yeah and maybe i don't know made it make a trivia out of that so, so, so I, I almost taste it <laughs> it's it's uh, e3 ah. so close so close thanks for listening and signing off jose fuck you donald what? trump <laughs>